going on, guys? Welcome to Griggles TV Daily, your source for daily tech news. Make sure you subscribe so you know what's going on in the world of tech, guys. We're about 1,500 subscribers away from 20,000. We have until March 15th, so we can meet that goal of doing the big, big giveaway of either PS4 Pro, Xbox One, Nintendo Switch, or something in that price range realm. So make sure you're sharing my videos. Make sure you subscribe if you're not already, guys. Let's get into the news. First story is about the Galaxy Tab S3. It leaked some new images out into the world, and it looks like the whole front part of the tablet is made of glass, and the back is made of metal. The front being glass means that this tablet could break or scratch very easily on that glass part, and on the back, it's gonna be very easy to scratch that up. Metal especially is very scratch easy. Also, if you're thinking about this, it's gonna be slippery as well. Glass and metal sometimes are very slippery, and you're gonna probably wanna be able to put a case on there, and obviously probably a tempered glass protector if there are any out in the world. And the more I see this tablet, it looks almost identical to the Galaxy Tab S2, which was a very nice tablet. And uh, obviously this tablet almost has the same as I expect with that 9.7 inch, uh, four by three aspect ratio, a Snapdragon 8, 24 gigabytes of RAM, and I believe it's supposed to have 32 gigabytes of internal storage. This tablet should be announced at Go uh, Mobile World Congress and retail for about $600. Next up is about the Galaxy S7, S7 Edge. Now, if your S7, S7 Edge has Nougat now, you can actually sideload the secure folder app through Sam Mobile's website. Now, this app isn't out directly on the Google Play Store or the uh, Samsung App Store. It should be fairly soon, but if you wanna load this app up, you can by sideloading it. Now, the cool little Easter egg in here is showing you, when it's showing you the little demo of how this app works, it's showing you a Galaxy S8. You can see on the front, it's got that 90% aspect ratio, no physical home button at the bottom, and a huge screen. Now, to me, it looks exactly like a Galaxy S8, S8 Plus, and also, it's a really good tease from Samsung to put this in the app as a kind of demo and get our uh, appetites and our mouths thirsty for this new Galaxy S8. And lastly, if you are a fan of virtual reality VR headsets, Samsung will have a brand new VR headset for the Galaxy S8, S8 Plus. The model number on this is the Samsung Gear VR SMR324, and it's gonna come with a single hand controller. That is great because it means that you're actually gonna have some bit of control when you're in the app or within the game that you're playing. You'll be able to use that little controller to control you know, your movements, or actions in the game, maybe shooting a gun, something like that. I love that because there is a controller that comes with uh, the uh, Daydream VR headset from Google, and Samsung to add this is very important because a lot of the other VR headsets have this as well, and now if Samsung adds it, you know it's gonna be nice, you know it's gonna be good quality, you know it's gonna work really well with their VR headset. So two thumbs up from Samsung uh, for adding this into their new VR headset for the Galaxy S8, S8 Plus. And one bonus story, if you use Snapchat and you saw their new spectacles, the spectacles are their, uh, their little glasses that you can wear and actually captures Snapchat videos from those glasses. They are actually on sale for the first time on their website. You used to have to go to like a certain location where they had a vending machine and buy these glasses. They go for $129.99 and they also are for shipping it's $5.99 and then there's tax upon that. I bought mine. Mine were about $145, $146. But if you want to pick these up, I will link them in the description down below. They went on sale today. If you're going to buy them, you're probably going to have to buy them today before they're sold out. Guys, Guys, thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. I do a new video every single day. Again, don't forget to subscribe if you don't already and share and like my videos. Put them on your social media. Tell your friends and family so we can get to our 20,000 subscriber giveaway. My question of the day is about the new Samsung Gear VR headset. Are you gonna buy that? Or obviously if it comes to the phone, are you gonna use it? Are you interested in that new VR headset? I know I am. I'd like to see VR headset get better and better and better. It's something I'm interested in. I just don't don't think it's fully there let me know what you think in the comments down below and my product of the day check down below see what it is thanks for watching guys don't forget to subscribe i will see you down the road peace